Some time ago, I reviewed a movie called The Noodles of Nudeland. Now, to my surprise, I find myself doing another review of a nudist movie, Mickey's Summer Resort, which kind of made me realize there are plenty of directors in the nudist genre willing to bear it all. And that pun was totally intended. You're welcome. Mickey's Summer Resort tells the story of its title character, a 16-year-old Catholic schoolboy who learns a lesson in hypocrisy when he's hired to be a screener at a nudist resort. Little do residents know, Mickey harbors a dark supernatural secret. Complications occur when the resort decides to host an old-school naturist pageant. And Mickey soon learns that not all the problems this community faces come from the outside. For sure, the most interesting aspect of the movie is that it never takes itself too seriously. So that sets it free to get away with pretty much everything. This is a low-budget movie that was shot and produced over several years. So it feels like a guerrilla-style kind of production. Technical quality is definitely not its strong suit, but its clever humor and take on the nudist ideology make up for some other limitations. The script manages to slip in some funny meta-humor moments. You know, this situations in which the movie makes fun about itself, the genre, and the movie industry as well. A totally clever move. In spite of the nudity mentioned above, Mickey's Summer Resort is, in fact, a sci-fi comedy. A story that tackles paranoia, hypocrisy, and the public perception of what nudism, nudist resorts, and the nudist community are really about. Sometimes the plot wanders off a bit. I mean, you have a love story, you have Mickey's special powers, you have a beauty slash nudist pageant, you have a congressman trying to shut them down. All of these narratives feel a little inconsistent from time to time. Mickey's Summer Resort may be a super low budget movie, but its heart is always in the right place. The quirky premise, the unique brand of humor and its unorthodox approach to the subject matter turns it into an interesting and out of the ordinary entertainment. So I'm gonna give it a 7 out of 10. Thank you guys as always for watching. Mickey's Summer Resort is already available on Trauma now. So if you happen to see it, please feel free to return to this video and just drop a comment below. I will continue doing both English and Spanish reviews on my channel. So if you would like to subscribe, that would actually be awesome. And hopefully, I'll see you next time.